so for all the hateful comments, <laughs> I apologize. I'm sorry that I was not very clear. A lot of you understood. Hey y'all, how are you? I'm back and uh, I am headed to the barn. Got a busy day today. Wanted to get out here this morning and uh, try to get some things done before it gets so hot because it's gonna be so hot later. And um, we have softball. We have softball all week, every day but Wednesday. Uh, and technically, Emily still has softball that day because she does hitting lessons on Wednesday evenings usually. So, uh, yeah, busy week around here. I'm not sure how much content I'm going to be able to do because we are so busy. I also have to finish cleaning out my studio. And, uh, yeah, I may take y'all along for that and let you see it. But I also want to give you a few updates on my last video. Apparently, there was a little confusion, but I'll get to that in just a bit. Are you trying to talk to me? Huh? Yeah? I heard you trying to bray. Yeah. What are you two doing? Huh? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. No treats. Ha <laughs> ha. I don't have treats. No. I'm going to come in and give you all some water. What are you doing? Hmm? You stink. Yeah. You are a smelly goat. Yes, you're, you're doing your job, so that's good. Yeah. <laughs> Copper. Excuse me. What are you doing? Huh? You just nibbling? Hmm? Licking me? What are you doing, sister? Hmm? Did you miss me? I hear you over there. We need rain so bad. Oh my goodness. Don't we, Phoebes? You need some rain, Phoebes? Hmm? <laughs> what is it? Hmm? What do you think? You want to drink out of the faucet, Lucy? Huh? Oh, dip your face in it, huh? <laughs> what do you think? Are you so hot already? You shouldn't be. It's not too hot yet. Let me water you. Hmm? Hmm. We like to water our donkey poodles, too. They enjoy it. <laughs> Okay, I gotta fill up the water. What is it? Hmm? What is it? I don't have treats. Nope. Fallon. Come here, Fallon. Are you mad at me? Huh? Because I took your mama? Huh? What is it, Goose? Oh, yeah? Oh, <laughs> talking to me? Good morning to you too. Oh, okay. Hey, sister. Hey, you gonna get a drink? Huh? Yeah, you gonna get a drink? Hey, come here. Let me see your face. Yeah, let me see your face. Who's a sweet girl? What is it, Farah? Hmm. What is it? <laughs> what are we doing here? <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all are knocking me over. <laughs> hey, Fallon. Fallon got to put her butt on me every time. Hey, hey, get back. <laughs> okay, I can't squat down with them anymore. Not for very long. <laughs> okay, I got to turn off the water. Yeah. I gotta turn off the water. <laughs> I was trying to sit down uh, to have a little chit chat, uh, but these babies are not letting me. So I'm gonna stand for this and uh, hopefully I can get through it <laughs> without them failing, without them being too distracting. So 
Last video we did, we took Freedom to a friend of ours. She, uh, she has a really nice little farm and she's got all kinds of farm animals. And she offered, like we, we met up at a ball game, saw each other at a ball game uh, a few months back. And she knew I had all these mini donkeys. And she said, hey, I have this really cute, she actually said she had two uh, jacks that um, we could breed one of our females to if we ever wanted to. And I was like, oh, that might be cool. I mean, we have a Jack, we have Steve. Um, but yeah, I might, I might take you up on that. And so anyway, Daniel and I talked and we have several gray females, as, as y'all know, and Steve is gray. Well, Freedom is gray as well, but I would like to add some more color to our herd. Yes, we have these spotted little babies around here, but they will not be having babies for a while. Um, probably till they're two, uh, around two, two and a half. We decided with Freedom, since she's the, the only female here we have other than the babies that aren't bred, um, to take her over to one of Marie's Jacks. He is very cute and colorful, as y'all saw. And uh, apparently I wasn't super clear on the video, and I apologize for that. But we are not getting rid of Freedom. She is not permanently staying there. She went, as Lester called it, as I found out <laughs> uh, through all of Lester's fans that follow over here, um, to band camp is what Lester calls it, apparently. Uh, she went to be bred to the Jack. We took her over there. They got introduced. Marie has since sent me some pictures and videos of Freedom, and she's doing great. Uh, they have not bred yet, but usually it takes a few weeks for the Jack to get her to come back in the cycle. And so Marie's keeping an eye on her and keeping me updated on that. But we will go see her uh, in a few weeks. Just check on her, update update y'all, and, and let you see where she's staying and all that good stuff. Um, nothing's wrong with Steve. He's great. He might be a little frustrated because he hasn't had a girlfriend in a while but we will more than likely um after fancy right here after she has her baby the next time it's time for her to have a baby we will breed her with steve um i'm not sure on the other two what we're gonna do yet but we'll see this is i mean i did get these these new donkeys basically as not just as pets but we are a farm and as you know with a real farm, a working farm, um, people add livestock, they sell livestock. We've done that with our goats for years. And so, um, yes, the, the donkeys kind of became a pet thing for us, started off as a pet thing. Uh, but ultimately, I mean, we are, we will have to sell some of the babies, give them away, sell them. Uh, Stephen Freedom's first baby, we gave away to some good friends of ours and I'm I'm trying to talk them in uh to taking the next baby that is born here if it's a girl because it won't be related to to Kane to baby Kane so I'm hoping they they take the next girl and then they can have little little mini babies at some point so um that's kind of what we're, we're planning on doing. We, we can't keep every baby that we have. I mean, that's ideal, I guess, but we don't have the pasture for that. And uh, we are a farm, and ultimately, that's what farms do. Um, they sell and buy livestock all the time, uh, whether it's cows, goats, all that kind of stuff. And so it's no different than these sweet little donkeys. Um, now, obviously, some of these these babies are are my my pets uh i bottle fed some of them and um well i bottle fed phoebe and the other one was a bottle baby and of course fallon she's she's probably not going anywhere she is my baby so uh yeah she's not going anywhere but um yeah i just wanted to update and clarify that freedom is is not gone forever she is coming back probably in a couple of months uh hopefully uh, we can at least see a few successful breedings, like actually get eyes on it. And then we'll know uh, that she's probably done breeding and we'll bring her back home and we'll bring y'all along for that. We won't leave you in the, in the dark on that. Uh, so for all the hateful comments, <laughs> I apologize. I'm sorry that I was not very clear. A lot of you understood uh, what we were doing, but some of you didn't. So uh, 
I'm sorry and I apologize. Next time I will do better. I will say that day was extremely hectic. We had like all kinds of things going on and not enough time. And it seemed like every move we made, something else would come up that wasn't in our, <laughs> that wasn't helping our time constraints. So anyhow, I am going to finish up playing down here. I got them all watered. Uh, their water's topped off and I've got some orders to fill. We have softball tonight. Uh, I will probably be going by the studio this afternoon to um, try to finish packing and cleaning out. Fallon, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, you're not Fallon. You're Fallon. They look the same from the top sometimes. Uh, so anyway, yeah. Uh, if Hopefully I can get some clips of Emily playing softball tonight too. And if I do, I will uh, share them here. So... Follow along. All right, I am sweating, but I made it into the garage. And now I'm gonna fill some orders, but I want y'all to look. I've been decorating a little bit, bringing stuff from my studio, putting it up on the walls in here. We've got a few things that still need to be hung up. Uh, and I've got other pictures around, but yeah, look. Look at those. Look at my babies. I didn't have just uh, pictures of my kids in the studio, but I did have one section of their sports stuff. So uh, that has made its way over here. And I love it. It looks so good. Yeah, nobody else really sees all this stuff, but you know, it's okay. Sometimes we have friends come over and they come in here and so they get to see it, but I do ultimately. And I took those and their memories, I love it. So I'm gonna do some orders and uh, go back and finish my laundry. Yay, sounds like fun, huh? We will be um, launching soon. I'm super excited. We're getting all that stuff going. And hopefully, I'm hoping we get to launch a Labor Day, but I'm not sure if that's gonna happen. So no promises. You know, stuff is um, hard to get, for sure. Let me see, that did not print, so there it goes. the exact same things back to back. What are going I have gotten in some new hats, which I'm excited about. Um, I'm supposed to be getting at least two more shipments of hats, but as you know, those, those are a whole nother beast trying to get those here quickly. So hopefully they'll all be here by the time we uh, do our launch, but I'm not counting on it. I do have to show you one other thing though that I'm very excited about. Y'all, new Arctic Yeti cups. They're not Yetis, they're Arctic cups. But look, they're the beach color. And hopefully it may be backwards, but it says, do your best. And it has a little donkey right there. I'm so excited. I've been using mine already every day. I love it. It's 30 ounce. And so these will be for sale whenever we launch. Well, also, I'm also waiting on uh, mugs, uh, just like this Arctic cups that are coffee cups. And, but they will be navy blue. And I will show you all those as soon as they come in. But I'm gonna get going on these orders and uh, yeah, we'll see where the day takes us. I picked up this dude from school and now we are at my studio and I'm getting stuff cleaned up. Got a little bit left, got a few things on the wall, not a whole lot. Gotta take that with me. Gotta take the lamp, you know, just little stuff uh, in here. It's a little sad, but you know, 
you know when you know it's time. And uh, it's time. So, yep, things are moving right along. Oh, probably will be complete, completely out of here within, within the week or so, uh, depending on how much time we have because, you know, it's softball. So, uh, anything else? What do you think? No? Is, is it going to be weird not having this? Yeah. Yeah, it is. I'm going to miss it a little bit, but, you know, pretty busy with everything else going on, so... All right, softball's up next. Emily. Emily got hit with the ball. <laughs> <laughs> 